Hi, I'm Maddie Greaves, and I'm from Lincoln High. You know? Okay. And this is my poem called Lovos Kinds of Happy after Abri Oof, Gabrielle Calpacresi. I have been single for 453 days. I mean, that's only a rough estimate. I'm not actually counting or anything, and it's not that I'm... Uh, <laughs> It's not like I'm preoccupied with questions about my lovability when I should be focusing on distinctive traits of third wave civilizations. And it's not like watching American Dad consumes me with hopelessness and jealousy because, obviously, Stan and Francine Smith have a special connection that I will never be able to find with someone else. But every once in a while, there comes a day where the knots in my sternum loosen themselves and I can breathe without constriction. My toxic thoughts are nowhere to be found, and I am walking on cotton balls. Those days I don't want to feel love are liberating. I can throw my arms out and spin through the sidewalks, because today no one will hold my hand in the hallway or kiss me behind the school. Today I am allowed to be the kind of happy that sneaks up behind you and slaps you in the face, crashes over your head and soaks through your skin. Today the world is my swimming pool. And I am free falling from the high dive. The world is a swing set propelling me high enough to scrape my knees on the stars. You see, I wish this was something you could bottle. A perfume Natalie Portman would delicately spritz onto her wrists while giving the camera a sultry look in a independent has never smelled so good. I wish this was something I could put on my dresser in between my hairbrush and my school ID because it's not every day I can listen to songs that even reference love without crying like Taylor Swift in the video for Blank Space. Platonic is not a four-letter word, but it's not every day. Just friends is good enough. All the butterflies in my stomach have migrated up to the searing flames in my chest, their wings crumpling up like bits of tissue paper, so all what's left are burnt leaves at the pit of my belly. I love so much my bleeding heart has stained the sleeves of all my favorite sweaters. And look at me, using love in a poem like I've been on a date any more fulfilling than watching a straight-to-DVD Disney sequel. Like, I've been on a date at all since freshman year. Like, I don't feel constantly suffocated by this longing for someone. Anyone? The only thing I love is being in love. I love being in love. Like, I love the days my lungs won't deflate like punctured balloons when he bumps my shoulder in the hallway. The days I can talk to him without choking on my heartbeat. I love the days I realize before I hit send that texting him the links to songs that make me think of him is less than subtle. I love the days I'm rational enough not to smile so wide my face could crack like tarnished porcelain when he sends me songs back. Thank you.